women must be part of decision making at all levels and that there should be an assessment and knowledge based and informed uh, formulation of policy based on the impact differential disproportionate differentiated impact on women and girls of uh, climate change we must see gender equality and women's empowerment as an organizing principle as as an important guiding principle of this agreement because half of humanity the impact on them their agency must be uh, factored in in a major way otherwise you will not get effective and sustainable climate action